Hello everyone, Dark Blaine here, back playing some more AFK Arena. And in this video, I am back on my main account. The Abyssal Expedition has just uh, begun, so I just want to go ahead and look at what the B Abyssal Expedition looks like. And yeah, just, just to look at it here. So let's get on with the video. Okay, so I'm going to go over to the Abyssal Expedition. I'm going to go over to the Dark Forest and go over to the Abyssal Expedition here. Yeah, it, ha it has begun, so I will be able to actually go inside the Abyssal Expedition. So yeah, that, that, that means the enrollment process has ended and you, you will... And if you did not enroll in the Abyssal Expedition, you will not be able to. So yeah, you will not be able to actually get into the Abyssal Expedition if you uh, did if you did not enroll when the enrollment process was there. So yeah, this is what it looks like. Yeah, the the rules were you just pretty much you battle these uh, tiles, which they're called. These ones are called villages. Village one. Go ahead and you can just click on uh, the tiles here. You can attack them. I can't, I, I, there, there is, there is a maximum amount of tiles you can collect. As you can see right now, I, I'm at 25. This max, this max does increase as you gain titles. So yeah, you'll be able to do collect more, uh, tiles. Yeah. And as you can see, we're starting, uh, my, my group here is starting to connect. Uh, tiles here and yeah this this map has been split into three sections there's this north section there's like this west section here and then the east section right here I'm in the north section I'm right about here in the north section so we're all trying to make it to this boss right here so yeah we're that that's what we're current currently trying to do here and yeah you just and the more uh, tiles you have, the more rewards you can get, the more resources you can get from these tiles here. So as you can see, there's like this coin, AFK timer here, and I collected a uh, relic here. You can get some relics here. And the and the uh, better tier of village you have, the better uh, the better uh, relics you'll get. So yeah, with it, you'll 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 get better relics from, let's say a, a a town one here. This is a town one. You'll get better relic, better stuff from here than you will get from a like village one. So yeah, definitely make sure you are definitely make sure you're doing this abyssal expedition every day. Every single day is is very important for the abyssal expedition. Yeah, I feel like as I feel like as long as you're you're playing it at least I would say at least twice a day, you'll be able to make it to the prince rating. And yeah, over, overall, I'm just gonna show the the titles here now. You start off as squire, and then yeah, this 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 is this is how you uh, increase your title. You complete these missions here, and there's. For each uh, title increase, there's uh, six, I believe, uh, six missions you have to complete. I've already completed three of the six for for Baron. So yeah, as soon as you complete all the missions, you'll be able to upgrade your title. You start off as Squire, and then you go go uh, to Knight, and then then you can go to Baron, which is the one I'm at now. I'm already I'm already at Baron, so yeah, I've already completed all the Knight requirements. And uh, each time you complete, each time you uh, upgrade your title, you get the rewards. And you can also get uh, tile limits, relic level caps, and you can also get some heroes available. So as you can see, the uh, tile limit raises up to 30, and the level cap raises up to level 3 for the next uh, rank here. And, yeah, you can go ahead and use... Uh, the hero slots here. The uh, hero slots are where you'll you where you'll put your heroes, and this is where you'll see how much stamina your heroes have. 
as you can see, I'm, I have pretty much all of, almost all the uh, slots I've filled up so far have been Rangers. Except for Rowan and Saurus. Rowan's there for the uh, energy and Saurus does really pretty well in the bosses. Yeah, I'm, I'm mainly going for the Ranger class. And if you look at the uh, Blessed Relics here, this is where you put your relics in for your uh, specific classes. And this is where you level up your relics here. As you can see, my Ranger class here is at level 2. Yeah, I would recommend focusing really on just on main, on one main one main uh, class here. And yeah, just and just mainly focus on leveling up that one class. And I believe there will be uh, there will be requirements for the titles where you'll have to level up the other relics. But I would say for now, definitely focus on just really just one relic, leveling up one relic. Yeah, until until you really get to that uh, point in the game where you have to level up multiple relics. Yeah, and here's my chat here. The mobile chat. This is where you'll see uh, every still people joining. They say they say definitely join early because the earlier you join, the more the more of these coins you'll get. You'll get more coins if you keep if you join earlier. I joined pretty. I joined very early. I was probably I was definitely one of the very first uh, people to join in the Abyssal Expedition, and yeah, I'm I'm already at Baron. So yeah, join, joining pretty early is definitely a good thing. And if you and if you haven't joined yet, you should probably do that because yeah, you're just missing out on resources. And yeah, the leaderboard is cut off because this is a beta, and also the military accolades is cut off as well. You look at the militia here. This is where you'll see everybody. You'll see everybody uh, that's in your group, and you'll see where they're at. And as you can see, yeah, there is me uh, at Baron. You'll see a lot of people are at night. There's some people at a squire, and then. Yeah, and there's also some people already at Baron like I am as well. So yeah, you'll be able to see where everyone's at. And there's this Militia Honors. This this is new. This is a new thing here. Uh, you can get uh, both normal and faction scrolls. And the way to and the way to get those is by completing these quests. Now these quests. I believe, yeah, these quests are just really only for the title, increasing your title. So every time you increase your title, you gain uh, these medals here, and you can use those medals to claim these, uh, claim these normal and faction scrolls here. So it looks like you get ten normal scrolls, and then it also looks like you get ten faction scrolls as well, total from this from this militia honors. There's another thing here, Stars of Dawn. If I click on the Stars of Dawn, as you can see, I I am I am a part of the Stars of Dawn here. I like I like I thought I would be in the last Abyssal Expedition video I made. I said I thought I thought I would most likely be in here, and there I am. I believe this is this is an order of the top ten, so this will be this will be the first person here, and then I'm second in overall combat rating. And yeah, just as a reminder, this this is uh, this is everybody in your group. So this is not this is not just your uh, this is not just your guild. So if I look at uh, the first person here, if I take a look at them, they're in a, they're in a different they're in a different guild than I am. And if I look at at mine here, yeah, they're they're in a completely different guild. So yeah, this isn't just for your guild. This is for everybody in your group here. And the spectator advantages you get. You get stamina recovery of all militia members is increased by 6%. And the Stars of Dawn players who have spectators will recover ten will come, recover stamina 10% faster. So yeah, the stamina recovery for everybody is increased by 6%. And the people who have spectators, which I have a spectator right now here will recover uh, stamina 10% faster. So I'll be getting even more stamina than than a lot of the other people. So, which is always a good thing. 
getting stamina faster is always a good thing here. So yeah, this will be pretty much the end of the video. I just wanted to show what the this new Bizzle expedition looked like. I wanted to just look at the look at the map here and just show the new features that they added and just yeah, just to explain uh, what to do in the Abyssal expedition here. And yeah, definitely definitely play this every day. And yeah, I'll definitely definitely do play this uh, this mode every day. It's very important that you do not miss a day in this in this uh, event. So thank you guys for watching. If you haven't already, subscribe, like, and comment. Anything you want to see me do in AFK Arena, and I might do it in the future. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. See you later.